Hello everybody, welcome back to Liver Diecast. I am currently working on a 57 Chevy. I also believe this, this is the main line, but I believe this was a super treasure hunt as well. Never did get my hands on that one. But this car, I don't know if you can see, but look at that front wheel. It looks like it appears to be messed up, broken, it's kind of shoved up in the wheel well. So we're gonna take it out of here. Um, I did take a couple of toothpicks, dipped them in a little bit of this nail polish remover, kind of ran it around the edges, waited a couple of minutes, and then I came back down. And we're just gonna pop, I never do this. I learned this from Nas. Never do the top strip, leave it, and then it's a lot easier to line it up when you go back with it. You just pop it up like that. And then I usually take a something. I'm gonna use this dry end of the Q-tip, and then I just kind of prop it in there like that to keep the adhesive to keep the adhesive from resealing because if I just leave it you know back down it will seal seal itself back up so we'll take that set that out of the way and my 500 subscriber giveaway this is the casting they wanted for their custom the 57 Chevy rod squad so it appears but that was just kind of shoved in there and got it to pop back out. It still rolls. I don't know if I'm going to use these wheels or not, but I'm going to sand it down, do a custom paint job on it, probably add some of my little tampos, and then I need to find some wheels for this thing. Uh, but I think it's going to turn out nice. It's kind of cool that, that they picked this. <clears throat> the 57 Chevy was my favorite car from the time I was probably eight until I was about 15, and then it kind of changed. But... Always had a soft spot for the 57s. They're, they are a beautiful car. Also like the 55s and the 56s. Always like the big wings on the 57s for some reason. They just set them apart from the other ones. So, but we'll get started on this. Uh, we'll get it drilled out, taken apart, and uh, I'll be back. Stay tuned. Welcome back to Live or Diecast. We are currently working on the 500 subscriber giveaway for Nikki Sakura, And just want to give you all a little insight on what we've done. It's back from the body shop. Beautiful red. Looks like it's got the treasure hunt symbol on that rear quarter. The T-hunt symbol on the deck lid. Beautiful red paint. Got our screws. I ended up going, I think these gold laced wheels are gonna look fire on this red. I can't wait to get it together and the glass and interior. And of course the original, that's what it looked like from the Rod Squad, the pink. So we did a, changed a few things. And so when we come back, we will get this baby put back together, screwed, rolling, and we will put it back in the package and get it shipped off to its new owner. Stay tuned to see the finished product. Hello everybody, welcome back. Thanks for staying tuned. Today is the final assembly on the 500 subscriber giveaway car. 57 Chevy, red, Treasure hunt symbol, got some details up front, some details in the back, and let's put this thing together. Let's get the wheels on it, and let's put this thing together and see what you all think. I did end up going with these gold laced wheels. I think they're going to look fire on this red, and we will get this thing together, and we will see what everyone thinks. Hope Nikki Sakura absolutely loves this thing been fun it has been a fun build I said the 57 Chevy I was I'm a huge fan of the 57 Chevy it was my favorite car as a youngster Thank 
And boom. Put the screws in it. Oh yeah, those gold wheels look good on there. That looks nice. All right, let's put our screws in. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day. Everyone's doing wonderful. Again, I want to thank each and every one of you for getting me to the 500 plus subscribers. When I first started this journey, 500s seemed like a lot. A um, hundred seemed like a lot. And I am just very thankful to to have my viewers watching and staying involved with the channel. Put the screw in there a little tighter. Perfect. One more little twist in the back here. And we are good to go. Vicky Sakura 57 Chevy is is looking sharp. What do you guys think? I like those gold lace wheels on there. It looks good. Got the details up front. The treasure hunt symbol on the rear quarter. Key hunt symbol on the rear deck lid. All right, looks pretty good, pretty happy with it. What do you guys think? Let me know, leave a comment below. Vicky, I will get this thing packaged up, we'll get it in there, get it all sealed up and it will be headed your way. I wanna thank each and every one of you for watching. This has been the 500 subscriber giveaway build. Until next time, this has been Live or Diecast. I'm out.